Investigators believe that they are closing in on a key piece of evidence in the 17-year-old murder of Molly Bish. 22 News IT reporter Ryan Walsh went back to West Brookfield today where investigators were searching for a car at a former campground yesterday. West Brookfield police today told 22 News they weren't going back to the campground. The search, though, is expected to resume next week. We know, we know that we found something. Private investigator Dr. Sarah Stein expressed confidence after a day-long search at a former campground in West Brookfield. They are following a tip that a person of interest may have buried a white car there. That car was seen in the area around the time Molly Bish was abducted in 2000. It would be wonderful to have a conclusion to, to that particular case, yes, for the whole family. 17 years later, investigators are confident they are closer than ever to finding that elusive white car. We did find some compelling information at the campground that will lead us back there to hopefully get us evidence in the murder of Molly Bish. Bish was taken from Warren. Her remains were found in Palmer, and this search is in West Brookfield. For the people who live in that area, they believe it makes sense the killer knew those towns well. I think probably that's true. The uh, It would seem like it would be more local than anything else. Investigators believe there is relevant evidence at the former campground. They said once they complete their search, it will be up to the police and district attorney to step in to start digging up what they believe they found. We contacted the Worcester County District Attorney's Office, and so far they have said nothing about this new investigation. I'm Ryan Walsh, working for you with the 22 News IT.